everyone. So I'm here to actually do a little bit more in depth of a review of my most recent addiction. And if you don't know what it is, I have a little bit of a wall here for you. So I have recently, and I'm gonna make a lot of this video pretty short for those who just wanna know if I like it or not. Ghost Gamer has become my favorite energy, um, pretty much energy drink. And let me explain a little bit of it and we'll go in depth about what Ghost Gamer has in it, what it's intended for and why I like it. But I, as you can see, am addicted. These are, I haven't tried all of their flavors. So far, I've only tried their Swedish Fish, their uh, Sour Watermelon Warheads, Sonic Cherry Limeade, which is a newer one, and Sonic Ocean Water. So far, my favorite out of these flavors, number one, Cherry Limeade, hands down, then Swedish Fish, and then this pal over here, Sour Watermelon, and then the Ocean Water is probably my least favorite, but that's only because I don't like coconut. Now, a lot of people are loving the coconut one, but it wasn't for me. So let me explain a little bit. So Ghost Gamer, it's formulated and marketed towards the gamer community. Now, I'm gonna be honest, growing up, I used to be a lot more kind of game focused and, and kind of in that gamer aspect. Um, but as I've gotten older, um, while I still play video games every now and then, I don't use the gamer for gaming. I honestly use it to supplement instead of having a regular energy drink. Instead of having a can of um, whatever the energy drink might be at the time, I have been, my preference has been leaning towards Ghost Gamer. The reason for this is because they, it's so it's a powder, right? So it's so much easier to, you know, you follow their instructions, you can do um, let me check here. I believe they suggest for the full two serving scoop, um, eight to 10 ounces of water. Okay. Which is fantastic. Um, and it gives a good flavor, but if you want a more potent flavor or you want something a little bit more mellow, you just add more water. So I love the freedom you have with flavoring when you use powder. Also, if you wanted to do one scoop of, uh, of this and one scoop of Swedish fish or one scoop of cherry limeade and one sweet uh, scoop of Swedish fish, you can do that. And so it opens up a whole new horizon for flavor profiles. And I actually love that, that idea and concept. So the reason I use it as an energy drink is because most energy drinks, you know, there are some high performance one, they have high caffeine amounts, they have BCAAs and they have CoQ10 and all these other things. But they, in the essence, they just feel like an energy drink. Ghost Gamer, um, it has more than caffeine. So when you look down the nutrition decks, the supplement facts, it is loaded with great stuff. So on average, right, for most of these, I believe they're pretty much the same. Um, calorie count will vary between them. I'm looking at it right now and they're five to 10 calories for two scoops. And everything I'm saying next is a full two scoop dose which again is another reason why I love it. Cause if you don't want the full amount of caffeine from two scoops, you do one scoop. It's so much easier to kind of dose and monitor your caffeine amount when you're able to choose what you're making. So for the vitamins, they have vitamin C, 500 milligrams, vitamin D, 50 micrograms. Vitamin E is, uh, I believe 1.5 or 15 milligrams, sorry. Vitamin E is 15 milligrams. Niacin is 20 milligrams, uh, B6, 1.7 milligrams, B12, six micrograms, zinc, 11 milligrams. To be honest, most um, energy drinks that I've looked and tested and tried over the last couple years and, and over my lifetime, they don't give you those kind of things. Like you're not getting zinc from most energy drinks. You're just getting caffeine and maybe the two or three other things they throw in there. So onto though their Ghost Gamer formula. I wanna be really open here. I love the idea that Ghost uses to be transparent on their labels. So many supplement companies, energy drinks, um, any of those groups, they'll say, oh wait, hey, we have a gamer formula or an energy formula or a focus formula. 
and they tell you what's in it, but they don't tell you how much of it is in it. The reason I'm a big fan of that is because if you're gonna say that, you know, hey, um, you know, you have to have, you know, you have to take in, I'll grab one, caffeine, right, to get energy, but then you realize that the studies of caffeine and energy drinks actually show you have to have maybe twice as much caffeine as the company put in the product. But you don't know that because they don't tell you. So I'm a big fan of these transparent labels. Um, so what they have is they have, and I'm, I might not be selling this, saying this right, but they have a, um, a, an ingredient called new LVL or new level, right? It's 1600 milligrams. It's been studied in the esports community, so the gamer community pretty much, for cognition and energy. It's supposed to help with reflexes and kind of like that, those coordination efforts that you'd have with esports. Um, they have taurine, which is another one that can help with energy, but also making sure to keep things a little bit more level um, energy wise so you're not like skittish right off the bat. L tyrosine um, is for mood and focus. They have 1,000 milligrams. Sorry, to go back, taurine, they also have 1,000 milligrams. But for L-tyrosine, they have um, 1,000 milligrams. Cognizant um, is 500 milligrams, and it's for attention and focus. Um, they have coconut water powder, 500 milligrams, which I love, right? Because coconut water and coconut water powder in a lot of products are there to help with hydration. So really cool, really good option to have in there while you're taking a drink for the day. Um, they have astrogen, which is supposed to improve the absorption. So different aminos or proteins, astrogen's really been studied to help with that um, improvement and increase of, of absorption. And with 50 milligrams, that's not a bad amount of astrogen in there. Um, they have theobrine, 40 milligrams, and then caffeine for two scoops is 150 milligrams. So I really like this because it's not super high in caffeine and it includes a ton of other ingredients that are supposed to really help with your attention and focus. I'm gonna be honest, I have been taking this and I've been taking it for, you know, right before I go to work or while I'm at work. And I have noticed um, a, a good increase in being able to focus during some of those more boring tasks that I might have at, while sitting at a computer. So I do believe that this can really could help. If I was to do gaming late at night, I think the caffeine would really help and the focus and the attention. But on the other side, on the flip side of it, um, something that I found extremely interesting is while I was trying this, my wife, she is um, right now taking care of our twin daughters and they're pretty young and she's always running around and you know, just she needs the energy and the attention span and the focus, right? She started using this and Ghost Gamer has now become one of her favorites. She used to try to drink an energy drink through the day and she'd experience the caffeine high and the crash really quick, no matter what type of caffeine drink she took. But she told me that while she's taking Gamer, she feels like she's actually able to be more attentive. While she, she gets a little bit more energy, just a little bit more pep, it kind of gets her up a little bit more. But then the focus and the attention she's able to provide, she says, is, is noticeable different. So she's quickly becoming a fan of this, which is good. It's also bad because that means now we might have to be purchasing more of these in the future. So. Guys, I absolutely adore this product. To me, it's a game changer. Um, I know they focus and, and use it for the gaming community and esports and everything. And these focus things are perfect. Give someone energy and focus to be able to have better reflexes. Um, for me, I'm using it as an energy drink and absolutely loving it. Um, I love being able to say, hey, you know, I took a pre workout this morning, but I need another, you know, pep, a little bit more energy. So I can do one scoop, which would only be about 75 milligrams of caffeine. That way I'm not intaking too much caffeine throughout the day. I can really control it a lot more. You know, you might say, hey, with a regular energy drink, you can take one can or half a can, but when you open a can, it's just habit to go through and, and finish it. So I do really enjoy this. Guys, I really, really have loved Ghost Gamer. 
everything that it's really offered to me. I feel like it is probably, as of right now, I know it's early in the year, but this is one of my favorite energy drink products. And I'm classifying this as an energy drink. Um, I'm not classifying it as a pre-workout. I would say this is an energy drink. For most people, this would really fit right in that in that column for you. If you're on the if you're on the the fence of purchasing it, give it a try. I think you will love it. But get a flavor that you're really interested in. Um, I, again, my favorite flavor: cherry limeade followed by Swedish fish. And then over here, the sour watermelon. So I'm excited to try some of their other ones. Guys, if you have any other suggestions of uh, energy drinks, pre-workouts, any drink type supplement that you're interested in hearing more about, drop it down in the comments. I'd love to be able to look at it and see if I can get a little bit to taste test for you guys um, and try out. Also, if you've tried this and you have your own thoughts about Ghost Gamer, let me know. I'm interested to hear what your thoughts are. And I'd love to also hear from anyone who's actually gaming. Does it help you guys out? Is it something that you've been able to get that little extra attention and focus and reflex? Um, let me know. Also, don't forget to subscribe. When you subscribe to the video, also hit that notification bell next to the subscribe button. That way you can actually know when I'm coming out with new videos. I'm always tasting, taste testing more product. Let it be workout stuff, pre-workouts, energy drinks. I'm always on the look for those things. So keep your eyes open and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.